What's up, everybody, and welcome to Watch With Jay. So today we are going, oh my God, this is like, this is so crazy. This is literally the last episode of the season. What is it? It's definitely the last one because I'm looking and it's showing like season. Oh my God. This is the last episode of the season and this has just been such a crazy journey so far. I am honestly, I'm not going to lie. I'm terrified right now. Um, the Fire Nation is literally at the North Pole, and they've been taking all season to get there. Qatar has gotten much better. Aang is still in a freaking spirit world, and oh my god, and Zuko, and, um, Zuko has him on his back right now. Ah, uh, boy. And then you got the, the drama with, with Sokka and Princess Yue, and that is a lot. Oh god, this is like, I'm really honestly terrified for once. Um... <sighs> I got to see how this plays out. So we're just going to jump into it. If you want to see the full watch along to this and every other episode of movies, it will be on my Patreon, which will be the link will be in the description box. If it's not pinned down below, it's definitely in the description box. All right. And make sure you subscribe if you do enjoy this reaction because I'm on the road to 10K. So if you subscribe, it means a lot. All right. Let's fiddle stick and do this. Okay. I'm about to start recording in three, two, one. This is not looking good. Ah. I lost him. You did everything you could. <clears throat> it's all right. You stay here, Momo. Hello? I'm sorry to disturb you. I just really need to find the moon and the ocean spirits. Go away. spirits they crossed over from the spirit world to the mortal world very near the beginning they call him the face dealer oh. when you speak with him you must be very careful <sighs> I finally have you when I can't get you home because of this blizzard I, feel, I don't know why I feel like the connection is good, but like I feel terrible for him. We don't defeat the water tribe before the full moon rises. They will be undefeatable. I assure you, I have everything under control. I tore through scroll after scroll. One of them contained a detailed illustration and the words moon and ocean. Sheesh. Don't make an expression, eh? Ooh. Oh, that's creepy. Show no fear. Couldn't he just cover his face with something and then he can't tell he's making an expression? Welcome. <laughs> of course, that's all behind us. Okay, we'll Why get to I the point. For something in a past life. Don't worry. Prince Zuko can't be getting too far in this weather. Mm -mm. I'm not worried they'll get away in the blizzard. Someone is going to kill them. What do you mean? How can I find them and protect them? <laughs> We've already met them, actually. <clears throat> the koi fish! Oh my god, you idiot! Oh. Be going now. <laughs> we'll meet again. <laughs> <laughs> hey, bye. <laughs> ah! But how do I get back? Momo. 
Oh no, where's my body? Welcome back. Good to be back. <gasps> <laughs> hey, I'm loving the confidence of Katara. Hey, this is some quality rope. We need to get to the oasis. The spirits are in trouble. Oh, no, no, no. I feel faint. I feel it too. The moon spirit is in trouble. He brought me to the oasis and placed me in the pond. My dark hair turned white. I opened my eyes and began to cry. And Dow the cornball. Slayer. Joe! The invincible! Get it off! Thank you, Momo. Please take please just <laughs> You're so stupid. the moon won't hurt just the water tribe. It will hurt everyone, including you. He is right, Dal. General Iro, why am I not surprised to discover your treachery? No, no, don't, no, don't you dare! You freaking dummy! Oh, now you want to run? No hope now. It's over. Oh, my, this is crazy. This fool. You're alive? You tried yeah, he to killed. Get him, Zuko. This is the first time I'm a bat for you. Get him, Zuko. No. You have been touched by the moon spirit. Some of its life is in you. Yes, you're right. Oh, please don't tell me she's gonna die. No, no, no. She's gone. That is so sad. Sokka don't need that right now. Take my hand. Are you stupid? Bombing out. I get it. I don't know. I've decided to go to the South Pole. Some other benders and healers want to join me. The spirits gave me a vision. When Yue was born, I saw a beautiful, brave young woman become the Moon Spirit. I'm yeah, surprised, Prince Zuko. Surprised that you are not at this moment trying to capture the Avatar. He saved him. I'm tired. Then you should rest. You too, Momo. Come here. <laughs> Iro is a traitor, and your brother Zuko is a failure. I have a task for you. God, this is the first. This is like literally the end of season one, which means that dang, I I leave them alone. God, I don't see Iro not no traitor. They're stupid. They try to capture a moon spirit, which was going to destroy and kill literally everybody, including like how dumb can you be? 
this was a beautiful ending, God. When UA went to the Moon Spirit, I know she was doing like I know like what was happening. It just oh man, that just hit me emotionally. Like it definitely like smacked me in the face. Like I was not prepared for that. Um, she looks so beautiful and. When she kissed, I don't know why. Like, dang, did anybody else cry at that part? Like, because please tell me, because if y'all didn't, then I'm just the biggest baby on earth. I'm just a big baby. <laughs> did anybody else cry when they seen it? Please tell me you did. I'm not the only one, because I'm going to feel so a bit like, dang, am I the only one? I'm the weaklet out here. <laughs> oh, this was such a great season. And, you know, I've, it's great that Qatar now is, um, you know, from what? He said, um, skilled enough to be able to teach and water balance. And now he can learn it on the way. So it's, this is just, it was just beautiful. My God, I, you know, it's like, God, Sokka, every time he finds something or, you know, he found something he really loved and, you know, he lost it. He already then, you know, had to say goodbye to his father. He lost his mother. All he got really is Katara and Aang. And even Appa, even though he hates when he lick him and Momo. It's like, my heart broke for Sokka. <clears throat> this whole journey has been crazy. My heart is like my heart breaks for Zuko too. So and I don't I don't know why I have like I'm drawn to Zuko even though he's evil. And I think maybe it's because of you know the way he got banished was trying to care for people and it just made and they called him a weakling. He didn't want to fight his father, you know. And it's just like he even apologized. Like he he doesn't seem like just straight a straight up terrible person. He just seems like he just really wants the love and acceptance of his father. And I think that's why I'm drawn to him a lot, you know. Um, but this was such a good season, my God. Comment down below if you want me to do season two. And how you felt about this season and what it did to you. Because, I see, I've been watching this season. I watched this whole season. And I noticed Sokka still has not did an abandon. So I'm like, I guess he's not a bender. Um, are not going to be one, which I don't know why I keep thinking he was going to be like, come find out black like, soccer discovery got bended, but maybe it's in the next season or something, or maybe it's just, maybe it just won't happen. Uh, I just was so sure he was going to learn how to bend, but I guess not everybody needs to bend. Um, soccer's like, um, you know, very smart, like a on, on site thinker. He's a really big, uh, He's a huge, huge, huge asset to the team. So whether he bends or not, you know, he definitely is an asset. So, um, you know, I guess comment down below if you want to watch the next season with me or if you think I should continue the seasons. And like I said, what was your favorite episode? Um, by the time this is dropped, I'm just letting you know because I, I was not dropping none of these episodes until I watched all the seasons, the whole season. The reason is because people will spoil it for you. And so I literally had to binge watch the whole season for like the past three days now. And it's because I just don't want to drop it and somebody be like, oh, Katara is going to do this or the lady going to turn to the moon, for example, like we just seen. And I've had that happen before on um, a movie like and I was just like, God, my goodness. So I just learned it's probably better to watch at least the whole season before you drop something. Just so that if somebody does spoil it, you already then seen it, so nothing got spoiled for you. So, yeah. But if you guys enjoyed this and you want to watch this episode and many other ones, as long as other movie reactions, it will be on Patreon, which is my link for Patreon will be in the description box. If you don't, um, if it's not pinned in the comments, it will be in the description box. Make sure that you guys subscribe. I'm on the road to 10K, so hopefully you guys decide to come join me. I love y'all, and I'll see you next time. Bye!